So I have gotten a lot of compliance from the male and the female counterpart saying, no, Miss Mary, I used a condom. I was sure he placed the condom, but yet I am pregnant. He refused to believe this and that. So that is why I am here today to explain to you how to put on a condom i'm going to be explaining i'm going to be illustrating it to you so that you have a better understanding and don't make a mistake i'm going to be telling you what to check and how to go about it right welcome back like i earlier said today i'm going to be showing you how to use a condom how to place the condom in the penis so this is the sample i'm using it's not a paid advert then this is what i'll be using this is my child's bubble so i don't have a a, a mannequin that should seek so i'm going to be using this to to explain it proper so when you get a condom this is it where you get it from the shop or just make sure that it is not exposed to heat for those people that sell condoms on the roadside, on trades, and they just go there to, to buy those condoms, they might not be effective. And the percentage that is going to break, is going to leak, is on the high side. So just make sure you get condoms from some pharmacies, from a good store to avoid the chances. So before you use the condom, it's important to check the expiring date. People use expired condoms without knowing. So make sure that the condom's expiring date is there. So for this, this is expiring on the 11th of 2026, November 2026. That is when the condom is expiring. So if you are in a haste to have sex and you check the condom is not is expiring on that day or a day before, please don't use an expired condom. And you also have to check, you feel like an air bubble inside to ensure that oh it's not leaking it does not have any exposure like it has not been exposed or anything so when you are checking it you're going to feel like some air bubbles just press around and see then the next thing for you to do is to open don't be in a haste and use your teeth i've seen people quickly use their teeth don't use your teeth don't use scissors don't use any sharp object to open a condom because why trying to use that scissors why trying to use your teeth why trying to use that sharp object it might create little little holes around the condoms and during sexual intercourse when you release that little holes the sperm might go through it you know most times the real sperm you're not even seeing it there uh, so the sperm might go through the holes and make that lady get pregnant and you will keep saying i use the condom i am sure so we've checked for the expiring dates, we've checked for the air bubbles, we've checked that there is no leakage, we have made sure that it has not been stored under heat. For the guys that store condoms in um, the cars, their pockets, their wallet, that's heat area, so be careful. So the next thing is to open it carefully. When opening it, don't use a sharp. So I'm just going to open it around. Let's see. Okay. Just open it, see it here. <laughs> you can see it, you just open it carefully. So most condoms, they come with uh, lubricants. Ensure that your fingers, if you have a sharp finger needs, it doesn't go there. That might actually affect it. So, so you can see from this side, I was finding it difficult. From this side, I have rough edges. I don't know if you can see it. From this side, I have rough edges. It was easier. So I'll just open. And this is out. So this is how a female, a male condom looks like. And when you want to put the male condom, this rim should be outside. It should be like this, not this way. It should be like this. So that is why it's, it's kind of slippery. So this is the condom. So let's assume this is the penis. You've checked for the size. You've ensured that, okay, this is the right size of the condom you're using. So the rim should be outside. That's the hole should be outside. Then you put it this way. Are you seeing it now? Are you seeing that? Then you can go down to the length. So it's just as simple as that. And when you put it, ensure that there is a hole. There's a space here for the ejaculate. Don't just put everything in such a way that there is no hole again for the ejaculate to stay in. So you move it down. In the... So this is not the right size. I'm just using this to give illustrations because I don't have a mannequin that has like... A... So if the condoms are placed properly they are used properly, they are not damaged, there is a 98% chance of not getting pregnant or sexually transmitted disease. So in terms of condom, condom is the only family planning method that prevents against STIs. 
Condom is the only family planning method that prevents against sexually transmitted infection. So but there are different types of condom. You have to pick the ones that is good for you. You have to pick your size. You have to pick the brand that you can afford, the brand that you know is okay. And also condoms can be lubricated with water-based lubricants to avoid unnecessary reactions and unnecessary breakage around, around it. I don't know if I am making sense. So this is not the right side. You can see it's bigger. So if this is the piece and this is the condom, it's going to slip off. But this is just an illustration. This is me giving an illustration to help you understand better. So don't underestimate condoms. For those that say that condoms are not effective, I've made a video on about six minutes about the use of condoms that I need to debunk and clarify. Condom is effective. Just use it properly. Use it well and you are going to get useful results. Do you have any question in regards to this? This is me coming out on Shemile to explain this because I don't want you to fall victims of circumstances. You understand? All right. So thank you very much. The one I opened, the brand I opened was Skin. The name of the condom is Skin. S-K-Y-N. So it's actually a good brand. They didn't pay me for this advert. So I'm just explaining. So you can check other brands of condoms and see how it goes. So this is it. I've explained it. I hope it's helpful and I hope it's better. One thing that most people make and I don't want is how you put it. Let me, um, should I give a picture or I should open it? I'm going to open the second one so that you see. I'm going to open the second one so that I explain what I really want you to understand. Just open carefully. Where are you? Come outside. Yeah. Is this rim? This, like, most people think it's like this and they just bring it down. No. This rim should be outside. This particular rim should be outside and you go down. You get it. It should just be flipping down. I don't know if you guys, but that's, that's it. Anyway, thank you very much for watching this video. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to subscribe. And also, don't forget to share with your partner. So they also get informed. So maybe the next video, I'm going to be talking about the female condoms. I'll see if I can. I'll buy the female condoms and make illustrations in the video so that you get uh, a better understanding of how to place the female condoms. Yeah. For those that keep asking me, I don't know why I just feel like talking in this video. For those that keep asking me, you know, Miss Mary, um, what other effective family planning? See, getting a good condoms is like one of the most effective family planning methods I can tell you. Because we have implants, we have injection, we have we have a lot of family planning out there. But condoms, I see, it's, it's big. It's a family planning that I advise. It's like, I think... If you understand I just see finish, people don't see condom finish. And that not be so condom is nice. It's not something you should like not see condom finish. <laughs> what am I saying? I'm just trying to catch fun with the whole thing. Just know that it's an ideal family planning method. It prevents pregnancy and it also prevents sexually transmitted infections. So thank you very much for staying tuned. Thank you very much for watching this video. Don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and also don't forget to share with a friend if you got value. For all my returning subscribers, this is Nosmes Mary saying thank you. Bye and see you in our next video.